So we're all part of the peer support class, um, and we have the opportunity to be a part of the See Different program. We decided to make an initiative on learning disabilities. So what we did for this initiative was we went around the school to classrooms and asked students of all grades if they knew what a learning disability was and other questions related to this topic. We felt as if um, that learning disabilities wasn't touched upon in our school yet, like no one really talked about them, so, yeah. so we hope you enjoy the video. What do you think a learning disability is? Um, somebody that needs a little bit more time to learn. Yeah, they need a little I mean, bit more attention. Yeah, someone that processes information a bit slower than the average person. Learning disability is probably something that like a lot more people have than I think. It's something that um, slows down your learning process, obviously, but uh, uh, it's something that a lot of people struggle with, I think. I think a learning disability is some someone that, like someone that has like they learn in a different way. So my own words, a learning disability would be uh, someone who has difficulty processing or communicating information and knowledge. Do you know anyone with a learning disability? Yes. Yes, I do. Yes. 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 Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I do. Yes. 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 Yeah. And do you feel the need to treat them differently? Um, well, maybe they need like a little bit more help than us because they do have like a disability. Oh, so, yeah. No. For me personally, I don't like treating someone with a learning disability differently because if they feel that they're being treated differently, sometimes, like I've been told by like, someone, my friend who had one, that like they'd rather be treated like normal because they want to be just like normal. You know what I mean? Like, they don't want to be, they don't want to stand out. They want to be like a regular person. Yeah. What do you do as a teacher to support someone with a learning disability? So first and foremost, you need to get to know the learner and find out where their difficulties lay. Um, and also, you need to be the supportive um, and uh, also uh, accommodate any of their difficulties. And then finally, you need to work uh, alongside all those that are there to support the student, including uh, the support staff here at the, at the school, but as well as parents uh, or any other adults who are interacting with the student at home. Do you think people with learning disabilities feel accepted at St. Mary's? Why or why not? Yeah. I do. I mean, our school is a very like giving and understanding yeah. school. Like we're all about like helping people, and I think like that's just what our school is about. Yeah. Some of them, some of them probably do, and some of them probably don't. At St. Mary's, definitely because our community is so welcoming, and even like when you come into grade nine, like. Everyone's welcoming no matter where your background is, what like disabilities you have, like all the teachers are there for you, the community is there for you, guidance, like the retreat leaders, even like we have social workers that can be there for you and like the EAs are also so like very nice. Yeah. Yeah, I think that they do because um, definitely here at St. Mary's we promote um, equality, whether it be gender or what you identify as or learning disability. Um, so I definitely think that the student body as a whole is doing a really good job at making everybody feel welcome. What kind of struggles do you think someone with a learning disability goes through? I think personally they just struggle in like Academics. needing extra time for schoolwork, yeah. needing a little bit more assistance during tests. Probably friendship, they probably like struggle with lacking friends and like feeling accepted. I feel they feel judged. Yeah. Yeah. Did you guys know that there's over 200 people in our school with a learning disability? No. No? no. Okay. No, I guess. No. Um, just thinking like people making fun of them and all that. Some of the biggest uh, obstacles would be timelines on assignments um, and uh, traditional testing, uh, where I see many students with learning disabilities uh, struggle. I think that it would definitely be uh, being treated differently. Um, maybe being bullied because like they might not take the highest level courses like academic. They might have to take locally developed or something, so they might get made fun of. Yeah, yeah or I think just trying to find the friends who accept them and are able to um, deal their best way with them. Are there times that you guys ever feel excluded at St. Mary's? Um, not really. Um, I feel like everybody's pretty okay with it. Like, unless you strictly tell them you have a learning disability, they really don't realize or know. Um, I disagree because I think that, like myself, when like, I carry my laptop in the class, and I feel like it's um, all eyes are on me, and you know, you just don't get the same kind of respect. 
like everybody else does. Yeah, yeah it's like um, whenever you take it in class and everyone's like, oh, you have a laptop, like it mm -hmm. makes you feel like you're done. Do you guys want to tell me at the time at the school when someone really understood your needs? Um, well, like, what? Um, I've already had like tests sometimes I need more time or assignments to need more time. The teachers are really understanding with that. They're like, okay, well, you got like a two day extension or maybe just like another day is all I need and just for like an hour extra for tests. So the teachers are really understanding with that. How would you like for people to treat you within school? Like what will make you feel most comfortable? Um, well, for me, like, treat me the same, I'm not that different, but at the same time, like, realize I do need those extra things. Yeah, just treat us like we're a normal person, right? I mean, you know, you just gotta understand that sometimes you do need a bit more time. That's just the way. Um, I think just let people do what they need to do. Um, think about everyone being different. It's not about uh, everyone having to have their specific things. It's being able to do what you need to do because you need to do it. For example, if I need to bring up my computer or my iPhone to get something read to me, I should just be able to do that. Um, there shouldn't be any stigma for anyone in the classroom, um, regardless of a disability or not. You should be allowed to use what you need to in order to access what you're doing. Is there something that you would want the people of St. Mary's to do? People of St. Mary's, um, support each other. Uh, you're only with each other for a very short amount of time. and. Um, be friends, keep in touch, so that when you move on throughout university and move on after, that you still have those friends and people to support you and move on um, through the ups and downs of schoolwork and work life and all the new challenges that happen as you